pretend the love we won't regret I feel the way I'm feeling too But baby I need more value the first thing you're going to need is a material, preferably cotton, and I purchased this at Michael's. I am just going to be tracing my Chanel stencil, and I printed this symbol um, from my computer onto photo paper so that it's more easy to work with. And I just traced that with a pencil so that no marker or sharpie will look through. And now I'm using my fabric scissors to cut it out precisely. Now I'm going to take my liquid stitch glue and I'm just going to trace the back of my Chanel symbol. And may I add, this glue is awesome. It's the bomb if you don't know how to sew. It is a perfect replacement. It helps the material stay together. And now I'm going to be taking these really pretty pearls and just spicing up the Jansport symbol. I don't know why I did this. It was really hard, but it looks cute. <laughs> Now I'm going to be taking these really cool lace things I found at Michael's and I'm cutting it so it's the right length and I'm going to be gluing it with a glue gun along where the zipper, well the fold above the zipper is and I'm going to be cutting these, this really cool floral uh, ribbon that kind of ties all the colors together and I'm securing it along the hook and making a really pretty bow. So yeah, this is the girly backpack that I came up with. Alright guys, so for my backpack, I used a vibrant blue backpack which I got from Staples and I purchased all this thread or yarn from uh, Michaels. And so basically I'm using a big needle and I'm using this thick thread and I'm pulling it through and I'm cinching it. And you can basically use that to spell out anything you want on your backpack. And I love the little ILY phrase, um, so I'm putting that on the back of my backpack and it's short and easy and it gets to the point without having to spell out I love you which would take forever. So I'm just doing that and that's what I put on my backpack. And now I bought these cute little stud packages and on the back there's little clamps that you can just clamp them on and I know the ones that I showed you said iron on but there's also some in the kit which can make you clamp them and that's my backpack. Alright guys, so that was our DIY slash personalize your backpack video. We hope it was really helpful for you guys. And you know, it's always great to start out the year with a backpack that nobody else has but you.